His artwork has been seen by millions. A book featuring that artwork and the brave service members he's profiled is a New York Times bestseller. And oh, by the way, he was also president of the United States. Tonight, George W. Bush attended an event at SMU featuring his artwork and honoring those heroes he has come to know personally. Fox 4's Richard Ray was there. He's live for us at the George W. Bush Presidential Center tonight. Rich. Good evening, Steve. It's been a busy day for President Bush. Earlier, he held his annual Warrior Open Golf Tournament tonight here. Portraits of Courage, his artwork, and of course, the book he has written about that, honoring the men and the women that he has vowed to serve in the years ahead. You've got to squat down in the middle. It was a sold out event. Hundreds coming to see the Portraits of Courage exhibit. 66 full color paintings, a four panel mural. For a president to do something like that for us, it's a big deal. All by the hand of former President George W. Bush. Portraits of soldiers who've served with honor since 9-11. Men and women who the president has come to know personally. 55 of them here tonight. Among them, Saul Martinez. I am stoked and awed by the way it looks. Uh, it's just, it's amazing. He captured all of my characteristics. He, he captured the look on my face and... Yeah, I'm impressed. According to the Bush Institute, the paintings and the stories behind them have produced the best-selling art book in history. It's been a runaway hit, the exhibit and the book. Tonight's event also included President Bush engaged in conversation with some of the wounded vets he's come to know. For you to, to invest your time and your, your resources into building us up and lifting us up and elevating us to a position where we could better impact other people and other veterans that are in similar circumstances is just incredibly remarkable. So I thank you for that, sir. Miguel Howe heads up the Bush Institute's Military Service Initiative. Uh, it truly is a love story uh, between a commander in chief and the men and women who served with him uh, since September 11, 2001. My goal is to uh, remind people that um, that our military is uh, awesome and that we ought to support our military and their families all the time. And so, A lot of inspirational stories here tonight, stories of healing. And Steve, that Portraits of Courage exhibit will be here at the Bush Institute through October 1st. Boy, Rich, he cares about that program. He does. It is evident. We thank you very much for your report tonight. Thanks.